No, no, I'm supposed to be all about healthy and lots of vegetables and, well, you can't do it all the time. You can't live that way. Uh, not all the time. No. <laughs> uh, so we're making a cake. Uh, and I stole this recipe in its entirety from Southern Living, so I thought I'd better admit it. Own up. So I didn't get in trouble. In the bowl, before you got here, I've got two sticks of butter. I've got a cup and three-fourths of sugar. Those work together. I added two eggs and a little vanilla. In this bowl, I've got the dry ingredients. That's two cups of plain flour, fourth cup of cocoa, and if that cocoa looks dark to you, it's because it's dark cocoa, and a teaspoon of soda. And we are going to put that in with, I promised you a cola cake, didn't I? We're going to put it in uh, with a mixture, and it really is ugly looking. I probably shouldn't show it to you. <laughs> a mixture of a cup of of Coke, don't use diet for this, please, and a half cup of buttermilk. Now, you can use other soft drinks. I've done it with other flavors, but not diet. But not diet. Right. Because some of them are made with things that will not, where the sweetness will not break down. Others are not, and you often don't know. But I alternate. You always start with dry and end with dry. Now, Jan knew that. She, I knew that. You probably don't know why we do it that way, do you? Um, because Granny told me. And exactly. That's all you, you got to know. Dang, she does know. <laughs> I hate that. But at any rate, we alternate those until this is completely blended. And then we're going to put it, and I may not finish that because, you know, young and the restless. Uh, we put it in a 9 by 13 pan. It bakes about 30 to 35 minutes at 350 degrees. It already smells great. Oh, listen, wait till I, now let me tell you about the icing. We're not gonna make it right now because we don't have time. I'll finish that up. When, uh, you need to take a look at the centerpiece while I get the finished cake and then I'll tell you about it. Look at those roses. Look at those roses. Each bloom has red, white, and blue. Food City Floral Department, what can I tell you? Look at this cake, look at this cake. This has a peanut butter icing, and I tell you when you get the recipe how to make it, but it's a cooked icing which you do something crazy with, and that is you pour it on when the cake is still warm. Right and get the recipe, Chef's Recipe, 6450 Paper Mill Drive, Knoxville, Tennessee, 37919. Sending a self-addressed stamped envelope or go to local8now.com.